Hey guys, this is DFD, aka Dark Frozen Depths, and this is a different kind of video that I normally do, or it really isn't more of a video, it's just me just talking for the most part, but kind of hearing the tone of my voice that not everything is okay, because more or less, like, there's been a lot more delays on a few things, like not just videos, but the series I'm trying to create, Criss Cross Chronicles, I'm like finding less and less time to work on that, and be quite honest, less motivation, because things are pretty rough for me right now, and I can't really deny that, because honestly, I've constantly had a, a whole bunch of, like, different things going on in my life that's been a bit of a struggle, but it's like, even I can tell it's getting near breaking point a second time, and I say second because some of you that may have been, like, subscribe to the channel for a while you might have seen the video before it was untitled and it just had a date on it i think it had may something on it or whatever but that was like i hit near breaking point on that one before and while i do refuse to hit breaking point again that it's i still can't guarantee things it's like things have been more and more like rough on me lately and it's like, for starters, I've constantly had a lot of issues with, like, on family matters and all that, but it just seems to get worse and worse as time progresses. Then on top of that, too, the few friends I do have don't really seem too much like friends anymore. And I'm starting to become more and more distant on them. And then on top of that, too... It's not like I haven't had relationships before. I've had plenty. It's just that none of them have worked out. It's either been interference by somebody that either got jealous or just did something just to be an asshole. Or a few cases where I have been cheated on. And in some, in some of those cases too, it's like the person that cheated on me did realize their mistake and tried to take me back. But I couldn't give a second chance because it's like one one major script like that is just ruined how everything else felt, and it's just, I couldn't try again on that. It's almost like a once a cheater, always a cheater type of thing, and it isn't always true for everybody, but it's still the fact that the stigma is just still there, and it's hard to give it another shot. As far as it goes with the job aspect, I've honestly had plenty of jobs, like, believe it or not, I've actually had things that range between working for mail service to even being in the military for three months. He didn't keep me because I was flat-footed. But it's like even the current job I have right now still pays pretty well. It's just that it's not stressful, but it takes a lot on your body because you have to lift a whole bunch of stuff and move a lot and everything. And I'm usually just coming home completely exhausted. So that's not really helping on the video aspect or anything else either. So it's kind of stressful, but at the same time, I still don't want to get rid of it because it's like I just got that job. And then on top of that, too, it's still paying pretty well. Because believe it or not, the one issue I've not really had throughout my life is money issues. So that's the thing. But... It's like I'm constantly getting issues everywhere else, and it definitely is taking its toll on me, and I've noticed that. It's not the first time either. It definitely still could be much worse. I've, Again, I've hit near breaking point before, but I can tell it's like progressively just breaking me down, and it's, I kind of feel like I, on one aspect, I need to have a break on a lot of different things, but on, on the other aspect, I'm not really getting the chance to. And it's just kind of sad on that aspect, too. And it doesn't really help that a lot of the stuff that I'm kind of, like, into is the fact is, like, if you take a break on it, you're going to miss out on just so much. And a lot of it doesn't really come back, either. So, it feels more out of obligation instead of pretty much enjoyment. And that's not really helping out on all that. And don't worry, like, this video did seem like it got pretty serious and pretty heavy, but 
don't worry, I'm still fine. It's just that I can tell that things are just getting a lot harder on me lately, and it's just... I honestly do need, like, at least some sort of, like, something better to just happen, basically, and that's, that's, it's just as simple as that. I mean, I've even, like, recently had issues with, like, on the dental front, too, where I came to find out that I actually had a dental infection as well, and I didn't really know too much about it until it got pretty bad it's not to a point of no return on its own right but it definitely got pretty close and i will admit i've lost some teeth i may end up losing it a little bit more but i am getting that fixed i'm getting that taken care of like i said money issues is the one thing i didn't really have and that's greatly helping in this case right now but it's just one thing after another with me and that's Mainly the whole reason why it seems like everything's slowing down. I mean, I'm even... I want to go to this anime convention that I normally go to. I've done videos about it before. But chances are it's not going to happen. So that's going to get put off for like another year. Or maybe at least a few months. It depends on if it goes back to its, um, its original schedule. Because you know the whole COVID thing and all that. But simply put it's just one thing after another and it it definitely does take its toll out of you and this isn't really a video for like pity or it's not even a video for encouragement or help either i'm not asking for that it's just to put out awareness of it because you never know who might actually be going through all this stuff and i've actually chosen to say something about it others may not and i even have to point out like one of the one of the past relationships i had dealt with a person that did not want to say all that type of stuff but you can clearly tell something was wrong with it and it might have been a mistake on my part to even try to go out with them because i knew there was issues and i knew there's multiple things but i still thought that would be something that would help them out like having somebody by their side what are we trying to be like their encouragement and it may have been a mistake on my end because it didn't work out that way and then on top of that they even did try to cheat on me too because they have like it's more like a case of, of a polygamous mindset that they had but that's a whole nother can of worms and i'm not going to go too much into details on that it's also not my place to say everything about it because there's some things they shared that they just that i literally should not share because that's just way too personal but that's just it you just never know what, what somebody might be going through they may not say anything, they may try to make it seem like things are fine, but there really isn't. They could be literally right next to you, you just, you just never know, but believe me when I say this, there's a lot of cases where it's just somebody might be going through a lot of different stuff, it just might be a huge struggle, you never know. But in my case, if it seems like I'm not putting out too many videos or anything lately, I apologize on that one, but unfortunately that's just how things are for me right now it's just like a lot of stuff that goes on and of course a lot of people can sit up and say shit happens that's a, a phrase that's been thrown around a lot but in my personal case it seems to happen a lot and believe me if i didn't have that prideful type of mindset that i do honestly have where i literally try to refuse to have things break me down if I didn't have that mindset, it probably would have been a lot worse. But even that still has its limits. And I can tell it's hitting its limits again. But like I said, don't worry. Things are still... They're not perfect, but I'm still trying to get through it. And I'm still trying to fix things and whatnot. That I may have actually screwed up on. Other cases, again, shit happens. I have no choice but to deal with it. But... Like I said, just a video to have a little bit more awareness on that. And like I said, I'm still going to try to get things taken care of. It's just going to take a lot longer than usual. Main thing in particular is definitely the series I've been trying to create. Because it's something I wanted to do for well over 15 years. But haven't had the ability to try and even get anything done on it. Until like the last five or so. 
and even then it's still taking long because I'm literally the only person doing anything on it. It's like I'm trying to be a one-man army like a, a guy named Zoon who did the Toho series, and I can't be him, but I have no choice but to try to because I'm literally doing this all on my own. All the programming, all the storyline, all the music, everything, all just 100% me. I'm getting little to no help on it because of the fact that the only help I'm really getting is free stuff that people put out on the internet that I can use. That's it. And it's just one of many, many things I'm going through right now. And it's one of many things I've been going through. It's been years on that. But, honestly, I just want to kind of like just end the video here. I'm, I feel like I'm kind of like dragging things out. But, anyways, that's all for this. It's just a little update on my whole situation that's going on right now. And, quite frankly, I've noticed it's not the only thing. It's kind of like, I'd say more or less stagnated in a way. But, who knows? All I know is this, I'm still trying to make things better, I'm still trying to, like, at least hope things will change, but you can't always just hope things will change on a whim, you have to work towards some things and everything, but, that said, I'm just gonna leave things at that, like I said, like, I'm still gonna try to get stuff out, and also, just, I'm just putting this video out there just to be awareness of all that because you never know about people's situations i mean there's even been previous youtubers that have gone through like some serious stuff first one that comes to mind is etika it's a shame that what happened to him but it's like a lot of stuff got to him and he unfortunately i do believe took his own life and that's just sad in its own right but it is something that happens and this is just a video to get more awareness of that, so the one thing I could ask for people to do is just to please share this video, please make that awareness more known, because it's like, you never know what somebody might be going through. You really don't. And it's just one thing that people just need to be more aware about. But anyways, that's all from me. More videos should be coming soon, I just have no clue when, but... That's all for now, guys, and take care.